It's the Winemakers on Sporting News, presented by Jack Daniels. Hey, this is a throwback game here. Pittsburgh and Dallas brings back fond memories of yes. my youth in those Super Bowl games. Pittsburgh on the road, one and a half point favorite. Total here is 44. Pittsburgh off a loss. Dallas off a great road win. And Pittsburgh's favorite on the road. Dallas has been atrocious against the number covering spreads at home. Yeah, they have. They haven't covered five of their last seven home games. And they come into right now playing a uh, Steelers team. That has been very impressive coming off a loss. 11 of their last 13 games coming off a loss, they've covered. And you look at them here, and, and one of the things you got to look at with the Steelers, right now three of their last 11 games uh, they've covered, that's not very good on the road. On the road, yeah. on the road against the spread. Um, but we're talking about mixing in teams like the Chiefs, the Browns. When they face a winning team, they've covered nine of their last 12 games on the road. And which is means a lot because it, they kind of get up for games like this um, and the Cowboys are going to give them a challenge and it was something that we see with the Cowboys week after week they kind of play to the level of their opponent so I have a tough time really siding with the team in this situation here but I could see some points going over all right I, you know and you talk about a massively important game winner takes a large step towards making the playoffs loser takes an immense hit. It is. It's, I, I think it's worse for the Cowboys. Obviously, there's uh, uh, a lot more competition out there. I mean, for goodness sake, in the AFC right now, we're, we're looking at the Jets still having a shot outside. Right now, the Steelers are in. They close out the year. They play the Browns and the Bengals. Games you would think they would be able to win at home, but you never know. Uh, Cowboys, I think this game is a lot more important for uh, right now. Cowboys, they finally get DeMarco Murray back in the lineup, get the running game working a little bit. And then the season-ending injury to Des Bryant. Of course, you know, give them full mark. I, I will. And this is, a, believe me, I know it's sports. I, you know, it, but Dallas emotionally found a way to win. Is the it a week, letdown? The week of a tragedy. Kansas City found the way to win the game the day after a tragedy. Then the air comes out of the balloon. Yeah, I, I don't think. Dallas is in that same spot as Kansas City. They have a lot more talent there. And again, like, like I said, all season long, they're just playing to the level of their competition. Steelers, good team. I expect a good game out here. But the last four or five games played in Dallas, the game has gone over uh, for the Cowboys this season. Look for a lot of points scored in this game. Our producer, Marty's going to kill me. we got to stop. But one and a half, what does it do? Does that, which way does this I, number go? I would go pick. It's going to come down to pick. All right, right Micah pick. says that number is going to come down. It'll be fun. Pittsburgh visiting Dallas on Sunday.